for these Blues at Enterprise Center. Puck is down, underway. Sammy Blaze coming to the bench right here. I think he got it right in the midsection. To the line, Will Borgen, that shot deflects wide. Veneers cleared out from the net front by the... Evans, and he was prepped for it, but yeah. Blay, who was, looked like he was going to initiate the hit, just kind of stops, and that's why he took the worst of it. Yeah, would have done himself a favor to go right through him. Yeah. A little, a little coming from a little yeah, guy. I was going to say, <laughs> yeah. he, he's another guy that plays with gumption, though. Yeah, absolutely. Yamamoto, former Edmonton Oiler. Centering pass, side turned away by Decor. On the back of the goal, Kairou connects with Buchnevich. Back to Kairou, long pass, Marco Scandella. Pass to Tyler Tucker, his attempt breaks the stick out of the hands of Schwartz. St. Louis, second straight year they missed the playoffs. First time that's happened in more than a decade, 2011, as Hofer makes a stick save to puck out of play. St. Louis with one more game at Dallas on Wednesday to finish. Turnover here, McCann sitting on 28 goals. McCann scores! He rips it home to get number 29 on the year and start the scoring for Seattle today. What a shot. Uh, I mean, this guy's got an all-world release. I mean, high to the glove side, and Scandella trying to dipsy-doodle inside the blue line right there, loses the puck, and there's the shot. And, and you see... I mean, Joel Hofer is six foot four, and here's the play off the right toe, and Scandella just knows he's got to just get that puck in deep right there. But what a shot. Well, you're just talking about his release, and that is Yamamoto. Unable to get past Marunovic, and Marunovic knocks him down for good measure. Centering pass, Schwartz in tight. Hofer got a piece. Tolvanen charging down the wing, circles the net. Banks it for Dumoulin, steered along to the right side. Schultz fanned on the shot, got checked by Torpchenko, and here comes Kasperi Kapanen, score! It dribbles through Joey Decord, and Kapanen has tied the game at one. And uh, the puck goes the other way, and here comes Kapanen barreling down the left side, and he gets a lot on this wrister here. Just kind of snuck it by that. Under the right arm of Decord, so it was a good play by Torchenko that forced the turnover at the other end. There's a shot by Kapita, and his Blues able to tie this one up late. Yeah, at t net cam, but he, he looked... I want a riser. <laughs> well, nice of you to join us here, and, and one of the things we were talking about was Joel Hofers and, and actually and Joey Decord, too. Both guys can really play the puck, huh? Joel? Yeah, abs I, absolutely. Um, Jamie Alexiak, even at six foot seven, he has some moves to him. Carried out by Bolduc with Robert Thomas. A pass for Bolduc. He thinks he scores. No, no, they say it didn't go in. In stride, right? Here's another turnover up high as the Borgen fans on the shot. But watch, right under the stick of Borgen. See, it's just a quick, gets it there. And oh, Bolduc had him wow. down and out. He just, he could have walked that in. Oh, that was that would have been a, about a, a one-inch putt <laughs> right there for Birdie on 18. And he decided to... Back and take it out of their zone. Seattle scored with six hits. St. Louis scored with 13. About half of those are probably from Tucker. Thomas rides in, moves it to Letty. Back to Thomas. Touch pass. Ball Duke. What a setup. Tick tack to it. Nearly worked. Who had just one goal his prior 16 games. And Kasperi Kapanen, who had none his last 14. Those are the goal scorers as we get the third period underway. The Dallas Stars, can they shut things down when they want to? Yeah, well, that's wow, that's got to be at the top of the list for a lot of folks that are cup favorites. Here's Saad walking out from the goal line, shot by Kessel, rebound, score, Jordan Cairo, and the Blues have the lead. And now being hunted down right there with a pass intended to go to the front, ends up. Get blocked, but Bushnevich ended up staying with it, getting it over to Sods. Kyra with some quick bits right here off the pad. He's ready to go right here in the shame. Well, oh, it really is. We're talking about Yamamoto playing center. Dan rotates it to Letty, left side. Thomas to the circle. Nice pass here to Letty, delaying, shooting, deflected on goal, but wide off a second effort. Ken Bolduc and Thomas, and 
Good chance there, the save, and there's where it went up and over. An awkward kind of angle on it, too. To the net front, off the post from Schwartz. Nearly stuffed it in past Hofer. And off the face off there, good play by Seattle, looking for the one-timer, the rebounds there. And, and it, it wasn't as close to the post as I thought it was, more to the side of the net right there. Able to receive the outlet pass. Blues wound up with three shots on goal. Schwartz carries it in with Larson and a save by Hofer. Vegas going out and getting Tomas Hurdle from San Jose, adding to their already stacked lineup. Stretch pass out of the zone. Here's Shen busting in on side. Puck check from Decor. The puck in the net. Penalty on the play. The goal counts. That's a big one. 20th goal of the year for Braden Shen. And from the defensive zone, what a pass by Letty. I mean, right up the guts of the ice right there. Backhand, forehand. How the heck did this go in from that angle? Hey, it banked off the court, but a great job, Shen. That's why you stick with the play. Oh. It goes off his pad and in. It went right, you're right, right off the skate blade. The court went for the poke check there, and then it goes off his left skate. Wow. And in. Right there. And then Toronto will play Tampa Bay Wednesday on TNT. Colorado Winnipeg 2-3. Nathan Walker to the empty net. He puts it away. That two good Sasky boys right there. And then puck right over. Blues win 4-1.